Ready position, okay? Follow along. The tip of our racket is at our nose, the butt of our racket's at our belly button. If we're in here like this, it's game over, okay? A lot of you are unorganized when I see you swing. We need to be able to shoot a basketball or a volleyball or a soccer ball in this space. Understand? Let's start with the forehand, okay? Athletic stance, split step, make a unit turn. Now, a lot of you have taken your left hand off the throat of the racket, but it's too early to do that, okay? Put it on the throat, like this. Okay, now make a big shoulder turn. Now we're not gonna put the arm out until we go to sit in the chair, okay? Leave the left hand on the throat of the racket until the ball bounces, all right? Now from here, okay, we're more than sideways, not just a little bit sideways. Make sure your back is almost to the net. Your front shoulder should be underneath your chin. Everyone tap your chin to your front shoulder. Do it. Let's go, good. Now let's sit in the chair and now we can put the arm out. Now our arm, look at me, pay attention. It's not like this, it's parallel, okay? Our strings are flat, okay, on edge. Okay, we can call this pat the dog, okay? The strings are closed. Now from here, from the ground up, we're gonna go with our legs, okay? Now let's lift to our contact point, swing out to the right, okay? Freeze at contact, freeze, freeze. Okay, so you, you can't be in here. It's out here. Everyone watch, sit in the chair. The swing goes from inside to outside. If you don't swing away from your body, you're gonna get jammed, okay? Now from here, follow through, shoulder underneath the chin, okay? Basics, backhand, okay? Ready position, make a unit turn, pull the racket along your waist. At this point, our right arm is straight and our left elbow is, somebody tell me. It's bent, good. Now from here, we need to get more than sideways. None of you are turned enough, okay? Our back needs to be to the net. We have to stay sideways when we swing, so that means in order to get power, we gotta turn way more, okay? Now we're all looking forwards and again, the front shoulder is underneath the chin. Tap your chin to your front shoulder, okay? Good. Now from here, set the racket on edge and sit in the chair, okay? You do not want to move your body like this, okay? Like you're bending your back. Don't be lazy. We need to move like an elevator. Keep the back straight, okay? Be athletic, don't be lazy. Now we're sitting in a chair and the racket is on edge. And again, we swing from inside to outside, okay? Now we're gonna lift, shoulder underneath the chin, finish tall like the Statue of Liberty, okay? Good. We're gonna just do the volleys now, forehand volley, backhand volley, and then we're gonna go through the serve and then we'll start. Ready position, okay? A solid ready position, I shouldn't have to review this again, it's even more important on the volleys, okay? Because our setup is our volley, okay? We're gonna have a no swing back swing. If you pull your racket back at all and you disconnect it from your belly button, the racket that your parents bought you is gonna smash and you're gonna owe them a lot of money. He looks scared, a lot of money, okay? Now ready, let's step with the right foot and turn our body. We're not pulling the racket. Okay, we're square with our target, and now step and hit. Hit and hold hand to hand, okay? Our body's at a 45 degree angle. Let's do it one more time, okay? We don't even change the grip on the forehand volley. Turn our shoulders and our hips, right foot, left foot, stay sideways. Good, get low, okay? Remember, knee touch volleys. Feel like we could touch our knee to the floor. Now, Backhand volley, two-handed backhand volley. Ready position, elbows up, good. Left foot, unit turn, okay? The right arm is straight, the left arm is bent. Some of you look unorganized. I'm gonna come around and fix it. 
you have pulled the racket back too far, okay? That's a backhand setup, not a volley. In front, in front, this is not in front. In front, in front. Ready? Stay sideways, step and hit. Good, okay? So now that we understand that, let's go to the serve. Feet sideways on a skateboard. Okay, this is the last one. Let's get it right. Lean over our front toe, be loose and relaxed, okay? Just let the shoulders hang. Now, shift your body weight onto your back foot and coil. No, 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 you're skipping steps. Don't cut corners. This is serious, okay? Step by step. Coil and then toss and do the letter Y at the same time. Now all of you are standing tall like trees. We should be bending at this point. Okay, everyone copy me. Rock back, letter Y, bend the knees and freeze. Good. Get your tossing arm higher up. Okay, look at the angle of my shoulders. The front shoulder needs to be way higher than the back shoulder. Now from here, let's scratch our hair, talk on the phone, high five, check the time, and make a letter X and hold your power line. Now look where my chest is finished. It's up and facing in the direction where I hit. A lot of you finish like this. So let's do this one more time. And at the end of the swing, I want you to finish up like this. Okay, I want you to show me a good power line. I don't want to see anyone finish off balance. Ready? Organize. Rock back, coil, toss, letter Y. Bend the knees, bend the knees, bend the knees. Now lift with your legs, comb the hair, talk on the phone, check the time. Sorry, high five, check the time, make a letter X. Much better. If you would like to learn more techniques, click the link in my description and take my free online course.